Hi, I'm Andy with Condi Technical Support. Today I'd like to show you how to configure your Epson 7700 as a network printer on your network. Let's start on the control panel. The first thing you need to do is have an IP address ready to program onto your printer. If you're not sure how to get one, go back to conditv.com. There'll be a video up showing you how to find an IP address for your printer. Once you have your IP address, on the front panel we want to go into the menu, which is basically the right arrow key. We're going to arrow down until we get to Network Setup. Once we're here, we hit the menu again, or the right arrow key. On Network Setup here, we get right again. We want to arrow down to Enable and hit OK. Once you see the check mark move to Enable, hit the arrow back, and then arrow down to IP Address Settings. Right over here, we want to make sure this is set to Panel. You do not want to use Auto. Once the check mark is on panel, if it's not, just simply move the arrow down to panel and hit OK. Once there, hit the arrow back and move down to IPSMDG settings. Uh, hit the right arrow key and the first thing we're programming is an IP address. We already have one programmed here, but basically use the arrow up and down key to adjust the numbers one octet at a time. Once you get the first number set, simply right arrow to the second number, program it as well. Once you have the entire IP address done, right arrow again, then we move to subnet mask. You want your subnet mask to be 255.255.255.0 for home network. Once you're here, right arrow again, and here you want to set up your default gateway. Now this is going to be the same default gateway you have on your network. Um, if you have any questions on how to do this, it will be explained in how to determine your IP address. Once you have your network, your default gateway set up, just hit OK and then arrow the printer back to ready. The program is now ready, the printer is now has an IP address programmed and you're ready to set it up on your computer. Now that you have your printer configured with an IP address, simply connect it to your network with an ethernet cable. Uh, once you have this connected, open your web browser and type in that IP address in the address bar of your web browser. You should see a status page on the printer. Once everything is good to go, consult condytv.com for instructions on how to configure your computer the printer installed on your computer as a network printer. We have one for both PC and Mac. If you have any questions or problems with this or anything else with, that you're setting up, just simply consult conditv.com for a video or call 1-800-826-6332, option 2, for tech support, or send us an email to support at condi.com. Again, this is Andy with Technical Support, here to help. Thanks.